In this podcast, we're going to be looking at one of the really cool effects that you can achieve using the Color Corrector 3-way. It's often referred to as the Sin City effect, um, but it's the process of isolating a single color and then desaturating everything else. It really helps draw attention to a specific color and it just looks really cool. So as you can see here, I have some footage of someone in a nice yellow truck. I'm going to double click this to load it into my viewer. And then from the effects menu, I'm going to choose video filters, color correction, and we want the color corrector three-way. So with that loaded, we now have a little color corrector three-way tab. If I click on that, it brings up these nice colorful wheels. Um, but more importantly, we want to look at the limit effect. You'll notice there's a little triangle in the bottom left-hand corner. If I click on that, it reveals the limit section. So what I want to start by doing is selecting the color that we want to keep. So I select the color dropper and I'm going to choose a nice bit of yellow. And then I'm going to drag my saturation slider to the left. Now what this is going to do is actually desaturate the color we selected. Of course there's still a lot of yellow so I need to add to my selection. I select the color dropper, hold the shift key down which invokes the plus symbol and I add to that so I can select various bits of yellow um, until I get a pretty good selection. Now when it stops allowing you to add to that selection we actually have to use our sliders so I'm going to drag the luma to the left you can see it starts to add all this dark yellow and if we drag that to the top it's added a lot of the highlights and same with the saturation so I'll drag these sliders pretty much as far as they will go. Okay, and then we can open up the color slider to use more yellow. That's done an almost perfect job. So at the moment, all we've done is desaturated the yellow. Well, there's a really nice little invert button which will um, apply the selection to everything else and keep the yellow. So that's how easy it is to get the um, Sin City effect. It will work with any color, but it really needs to be a vivid color, otherwise you'll get mixed results. So have a play around with that.